Welcome to our channel, ladies and gentlemen. Interesting and very tense moments in our country. I mean, over the last 72 hours, we've seen, witnessed, had just quite enough. I mean, what is really happening? Leaders being arrested, they are not produced in court. People are being butchered outside there. And then today, another breaking news that people are posing as DCI officers invades Uhuru's first son home in Karen. I mean, and then Uhuru runs there because he says his son called him that some people went there under the guise of the DCI and they had a foreign number plate. And they're saying that there's something that they wanted to check and I think some issues with the guns. And Uhuru is pleading, I'm giving you this video in a moment, he's pleading with the government that he handed over the instruments of power peacefully, even though he was not supporting this government. And he says that if they have something, let this administration face him, not facing a 90-year-old mamangina or now going after his children. There is a reason why this is happening before I give you this video, ladies and gentlemen. There is a ruling that is pending, the Okia Omutata ruling. This administration wants to intimidate everyone so that by the time we reach that moment when the ruling is being made, even the judges shall have, uh, you know, catch cold. The issue about Uhuru Kenyatta sponsoring, I mean, uh, the demonstrations, it's, it's, it's he, neither here nor there because people are on the street to lament about the high cost of living that everyone knows is now a problem. And so, ladies and gentlemen, I, I think we need to have a, a serious conversation about our country because if it burns all of us burn that is the thing i can assure you and uh, those who think that they have the instruments of power and they are now enjoying it i mean this is unacceptable let us unite our country because we only have one country kindly take a look of uh, what happened and listen to uhuru kenyatta the chief licensing officer uh, that uh, there are firearms that are that are possessed by the family uh, that they needed them surrendered um, the request we made is simple because the order was verbal we are happy to meet uh, the chief licensing office on Monday morning at 9 since the offices are closed tomorrow to be able to understand the request and to also be able to understand how is it that we can facilitate that process. That's all. Thank you. Perhaps what, what were the people that came here who are doing, what exactly were they doing here? Perhaps have you been brought up to speed with what they were reading this place for? No, no, we, uh, we, we hadn't, except the fact that they identified themselves. Uh, nothing else was uh, put to us except that verbal order. Mm. I think that's all from, from our end. Alright. Mm -hmm. So President, perhaps what brings you here this evening and uh, what what has happened here exactly? Well I got a report from my son that uh, he had come to home and as he was leaving the watchman at the gate told him that there were people claiming, because that's all we can state for now, to be DCI officers in a vehicle with Sudanese registration uh, and claiming that uh, they want to speak and to see him. And uh, I told them immediately, I mean, uh, from my knowledge, when the police want to do something, they don't come in foreign uh, number plates. Number two, they have a warrant. Number three, they state their case and they show and produce the warrant that is supposed to uh, allow them to do whatever it is that they want to do. And I told them, don't open the gate. Uh, and unfortunately, I was... Uh, in the office doing uh, other work so i just told them just keep the gate closed and i am now here 
And I understand now they have left. Because I wanted to ask them, what are you doing in my son's home? Mm. Do you believe this has uh, anything to do with the ongoing protests and, of course, uh, having the opposition claiming I, the, the, I, the government? Unfortunately, I have no other explanation to give because all of these things are flowing in a row. I have uh, a whole minister of government staying there that is going to do I don't know what in front of my mother's house. I have... Uh, people who have been guarding my mother for the last almost 50 years withdrawn at night I have now a situation where my son's home is being raided for things that I don't understand so I ask myself what does this government want because if it wants me the fact that I've been silent doesn't mean I'm scared come for me why do I, what, what does my mother have to do with anything? What does uh, my children have to do with anything? Come on, should they end me? I'm here. Right? Yeah? They know where I am 24-7. Right? Why, why all this? Intimidate a 90-year-old woman. Intimidate children. Right? If it is me you want, what, you come and tell us what you want. Yeah. Mr. President, they have been claiming that uh, you are behind the Azimil Omoja protest and you are funding the protest. Perhaps, what do, how do you reply to these statements? You tell me, right? And I have said it severally. And that's why I keep saying, maybe silence sometimes is not right. Yeah? But I have ignored it because I have asked myself, how? How? Yeah? What do the, the issues that Kenyans are talking about have nothing to do with me? All right? Have you seen me in any of those events? Have you seen me talk about any of those events? Yeah? Now if you say that because of my association with Raila, am I not supposed to talk to my friends? Is that a crime in Kenya today? Yeah? Is that a crime? Maybe you should tell me if it's a crime. Maybe you should say, oh, it is a crime to associate with this individual. With this. I thought the only crime was to associate with terrorists. So are you telling me that they are terrorists? Then because then that, that would be the only argument you would have. Or bank robbers or something. Right? Yeah? But I thought we lived in a democracy in Kenya. I thought, I believed. Yes? And that's why I handed over whatever. I may not have supported this government. Yes? But I accepted the will of the people, didn't I? You all saw me in broad daylight. Was I forced into that field? Right? See, I did what I was supposed to do. So, what, 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 what else do you want? Probably, uh, are there any steps you're going to take after this from this uh, particular uh, incident? This incident, I leave to the lawyers. Because they should tell me what they want with my children. Yeah? Do they want? They've removed their security. Now I hear they want to remove their, their personal weapons. So what? Are they wanting to do that because they are planning something? And if they are planning something, yeah, my only plea, don't plan against my mother, don't plan against my children, plan for me. If it is me you want, leave them alone. What do they have to do with anything? Yeah? How many people are licensed to hold weapons in this country? Yeah? Did they not follow the right procedure? Tell us. Tell the world. If, 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 they have, if it's a question of illegal weapons, <laughs> then tell the world, yeah, these people have illegal weapons. Right? But if they are licensed weapons, how many people in Kenya have uh, licensed weapons? Even foreigners. Yeah. Alright? So they follow the procedure. Right? So you will do their security. So they are not supposed to defend themselves. What do you want now? What more do you want? Mm-hmm. Uh, Mr. President, perhaps now that uh, this is happening, and uh, does this in any way waver your support uh, for Raila Odinga? Why should it? That is my democratic right. It is my democratic right. Yes? Enshrined in our constitution. That Kenyans voted for. Right? That Kenyans voted for. Eh? Mzee Moi died. As a, as, as a member of Kanu, and Kanu ceased to rule this country in 2022. 
He died claiming he is, I am a Kanu life member. Was there a problem with that? Was there? Maybe you should tell me. Uh, maybe uh, there was a problem with that. Yeah? He died a Kanu life member. To his grave, he declared himself a Kanu life member, correct? Was there a problem? So what's the problem? Uh, maybe you should tell me, maybe there's something that I don't understand. Uh, Mr. Pres president, the argument here has been that I'm not if... Mr. President, uh, the, I'm the fourth president. My apologies, the fourth president of the Republic of Kenya, uh, Uhuru Kenyatta. The argument here has been that if you continue politicking, then uh, you may lose... Have you seen me in any rally? Um, declaring maybe your support any for... Any rally? Not really, but Have declaring... You seen me, uh, in any demonstration? Not really. Uh, Have you seen me uh, uh, anywhere except where? And, and all, all my functions are public. This government knows all the activities I have been doing, be it in Ethiopia, be it in DRC. I don't do it under color. They know. Yeah. So which are these other activities? Maybe they should tell us. They're the ones who know. They have the whole system. Yeah? Instead of going on to cars to claim, 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 claim. See, that's what I'm saying. I'm here. Do you have to go and look for my mother? Do you have to go and look for my children? Right? Come for me. I'm here. Yeah? I'm here. In full view of, of you. Yes. So, if you have those claims, Sema. Shideiko Wapi. Sema. Uh, another question? Yes, please. Um, there are also allegations that um, you financing the opposition to frustrate the government. To frustrate know. them to, from doing what? To frustrate them from doing what? You know when you're a government, you're elected to rule. You're elected, not to rule actually, to govern. And to govern in accordance with the wishes of the people. Yeah? I am a retired person. Yes? Why, does, why don't they deal with the issues and the concerns that Kenyans are raising? That's what they should be dealing with. Not looking for scapegoats. Yeah, go, go deal with the issues that Kenyans are raising. Right? Have you spoke? When I was in power, I was dealing with the issues that Kenyans were raising. Yeah? These are not new things. Yes? Have, have, you perhaps, have you perhaps had a tete-a-tete -tete with the current no. president, uh, William Ruto? No. no. I mean, you have a tete-a-tete -tete with somebody who wants to have a tete-a-tete -tete with you. He has not shown any indication that he wants to talk to me. And, as a retired person, why should I go look for somebody who doesn't want to talk to me? Uh. Do you feel like perhaps the safety of your family is being threatened? Absolutely. And that's why I'm here. Yeah, And as you know, I have been quiet. But... Being quiet does not mean I will not defend my family. I will defend my family. Right? And I will defend it to the end. Alright? I defended Kenya and I did my best for this country. Okay? You may not think well, whoever has that opinion, that opinion, that opinion, that is an opinion. But according to me, I did the best I could do for my country. Alright? And I handed over when my time was finished. And I will now do the best that I can do to defend my family. Mr. Pre uh, the retired President, you called a Jubilee Delegates meeting on the, in uh, 22nd, I think, uh, February or May. And uh, the question here is, uh, don't you think that is a form of maybe actively participating in politics, trying to iron out and rest no, the no, affairs no, of the Jubilee Party? No. And I said it when I was even right there on the platform. My idea... And my plan was always to surrender my party. But what I completely rejected was the coup that was planned by this government to take over my party forcefully. And I said, let the members decide. But I will not hand over to some puppet group of people, all right, because they have government support. No, that is not democracy. That is not to say that I was not willing to hand over. I wanted to hand over. I was prepared to hand over. But what I found to be completely illegitimate and unacceptable in a democratic state is to be forced to hand over 
to a group of puppeteers. No. 